My name is Alex Yam, and I am 29 years old. Uh, I was diagnosed with lung cancer, and I was 28 years old. I was seeing an orthopedic doctor of mine, and we did a full body CT scan. He found a tumor on my right bottom lung. Um, I was a little confused, because uh, I didn't know a whole lot be, uh, about lung cancer. I thought it was really pertained to people who smoked, um, which I don't. So I was a little scared. Uh, I didn't really know what to feel at the time, so there's some mixed emotions there. Um, last June, June 2nd, I had surgery to remove the entire lobe, bottom right lobe of my right lung, which there, where the tumor was local, so it was localized the tumor and they took it out. And then I've been just going through some therapy and stuff up until now. I've had to change a lot of things that I do, like in everyday life, um, things I eat, you know, your, your nutritional program has to be changed. Uh, um, I don't have as much energy, I think, and part of that has to do with the evasive surgery that, that I had. Um, I've had some breathing complications. Um, I think it's important for young adults to know about cancer so they realize that there are young people that have cancer, that young people are affected by this disease, which majority of people I think believe that it's the elderly people that are affected. And to have a support system, I was lucky and fortunate enough that I had my family around and they were supportive. My sister and everything came and supported me. Not everybody has that, so I think having an outlet or an extension to people who, who can support you and who can answer questions you know, about your lung cancer or any specific kind of cancer is really important for young people. So I think this is a great program. A life lesson I gained is like something like this can happen to anybody, um, even a person who really has no symptoms or risk factors or anything like that. So um, I think it's just important to be aware of, you know, of your, yourself, your own body and what's going on and always maintain. I tell all my friends to get checkups and all that stuff. I mean, now, now I'm kind of an advocate for people who you know, for the health system in terms of getting getting your annual checkups and getting getting stuff like that. So that's really how it's really I think benefiting me.